What is going on guys? DBG here and today lads we're going to be doing a gameplay with a guy who's severely overpriced right now. We are looking for Mirasan. 11 and a half K. I get it he's the tallest player in the game. What's Hero Mirasan going for? Because Hero Mirasan can at least hit a jumper. Why is Hero Mirasan this price? I get it he's probably 20, 30k but he's got 25 speed. He's got 25 speed, lads. Come on now. Come on. Be be a bit be serious now. He just got 25 speed. Mirasan. Um obviously got a great sunny dunk. Great block. He's got 25 speed and 25 lateral quickness. You can give him 12 huffs, but like I don't think he's any better than Amethyst Taco. At least what did they give Amethyst Taco at Christmas? Like, what speed did they give Amethyst Taco at Christmas? Obviously, we got 80 speed Yao Ming in January. And we got 40 speed Taco at Christmas. And that's huge. It's plus 15 speed. So, Mirasan, at least he can hit the mid range. At least he can hit that. Like, you know what? On his other card, he can probably hit the three ball, I'd say. Like, his other card is... Like, what does he have? Three ball, his hero. 73. Yeah, his hero can hit the three ball. But this card's job is just going to be to do this. It's just going to literally be to do this. Drop step. Layup. Stand under the basket. Mash. Like, he makes Boban look small. Again, as I say, player builds in this game go number one, Taco Fall, number two, Manute Bowl, number three, Mirasan, number four, uh, Boban, number five, Simbular, and then there's Yami. So, like, he's a guy, if they gave him, like, 70 speed, he would have had potential to be better than Yami. But, yeah, that man is just tall. I mean, that's all he is, but he's not only tall, he is the tallest. Even though, did they give him Jordan Dribble style? Yeah, he's a 25 ball handle, but he's got Jordan Dribble style. So, yeah, he does get the Jordan Dribble style burst, which is hilarious. But, yeah. Anyway, now it's green at three. Let's see. He's actually got a 49 three ball, which means I actually think I can green from the corners. I think that's a possibility. Not probability. I think it's a like one in a million chance, but I think I, he actually has a green window. He's a tiny one. But he has a green window. I'm going to go till I hit it. There we go. I hit the green window. Let's go on to the game. I genuinely cannot believe that I knocked down a three of mirrors. I'm not going to do that in a game. Like, that was hard to do. That was so hard to do. Let's get a clutch time online. Let's put him in for Mark Eaton. He's just gonna, he's gonna just dump, I'm just gonna dump it inside to him every time. Like there's no reason he shouldn't at least be a semi-competent player. Okay, let's go. So we're playing against Pool Glen. I don't mind this matchup. I want to see who he has a center. Boogie. Okay, we can dominate him. We can absolutely dominate Demarcus Cousins right here. Just roll hard. Just literally roll hard, and I will score every single time at the basket. Do I cheat? Absolutely cheese him and go into a. I'm not going to completely cheese him, which is like going into a zone. Good shot. If you zone up in clutch time, you are just the lowest of the low, I believe. Easy layup there for Mirasan. Let's go. I look, he's got a 6-10 center. There is no adjustments he can... There, there aren't any adjustments he can make. 
there are no adjustments he can make at all that'll stop Mirasan. He can beat me. He can abuse Mirasan. He can abuse my 25 speed by getting Mirasan involved in every single pick and roll. But there's nothing that he can do in his defensive settings that'll stop Mirasan. And he's decided not to get him involved in this pick and roll. Oh! Because AI, what are you doing? I'm talking about Alan Ives. I'm talking about artificial intelligence there. CPU did something very dumb. Cut hard, Gasol. Okay, so he's only really worried right now about Mirasan, which means I'm like, let's get the ball into Mirasan here. He's inbounding. Um, run around. He's over committing, I think. And that should be an easy layup for Gasol. Let's go. Good steal, Badi. Ah, we got unlucky. <laughs> I I wanted to get to draw a jump ball, and he slapped him in the back of the head. And it's not what I wanted to do there, Marcus. All you literally just slapped him in the back of the head. Oh wow, let's drop. No way. Really, it's wide open. All right. Your time again. Mirasan, just get in front of him. He can't guard you. Drop step, go up with it. Good, come on. Like, look, he, he can't guard you. We all, they know he can't guard you. And my opponent knows that he can't guard Mirasan. I know he can't guard Mirasan. That's what we need. Come on, stop leaving the corner open. Oh my God. Stop leaving the corner open. He twice now just dotted the corner late in the shot clock when nothing else was on and got an open off it. Dunk it on him. Good, Mirasan. Come on. I'm there. Brick. My board. You know what, Casal? You can drill the ball to the floor. Yeah, that's what we wanted. That's the exact switch we wanted. I wanted two of them to go to Mark and just give Mirasan ahead of steam going to the basket. Okay, let's go. So I gotta manually fight over all these screens though, just because of the way the matchups are. KBJ is really struggling here on Glenn Wright. Glenn Wright's just killing me in general. KBJ hasn't been able to guard him. This guy's actually running plays to get him open. Good shot. I mean, my opponent's done well. My opponent's done really well here. Is that a, that's green? Okay, fair play. Drop step. He jumped way too early on that one. And it's a bucket. He's basically got to block the shot, otherwise Mirasan's got a guaranteed bucket though. Forced to cut, good. Why? Great defense. Great defense of three seconds call. Because for some reason, why did my small forward run away from... Why did he run? He literally... It's a brick. That should not be green. He ran away from Lou Hudson. Where is it? Cam Reddish. Cam Reddish literally turned around and ran away. He ran away like... KD ran away from the grind. About eight times in his career. Should be an easy dunk. There we go. Oh my god. How low is his stamina? He hasn't done anything. He's only 80. Oh, he's only 84 stamina. Good stand. And good finish, I guess. Oh, wow. Big board. Really? I hit that after missing leaner after leaner in the Marcus All gameplay? That's a great shot if he hits it. That's a really good shot. Like, Pool's tray fade feels different. I will say Miller's tray fade and Pool's tray fade just feel different to, mo to most guys in the game. Good box out.
Okay. Down by two points here. And we just need... We honestly just need Mirasan as a bailout option. Because if we can get open like that, we can take a two-point lead. Mirasan's just got to always be our bailout. The defense. Great defense. Oh, Mirasan. You, we, did, we did everything right there. We did everything right. Hey, come on. I'm actually getting annoyed at how many times it looks like he's shooting whites on free throws. Like, that's a legit green. Like that. If he hit that, I would have gotten annoyed. You know what? Dot him full court. Green. Come on. That's what Badier is in there for it. Hit that three. Okay, nothing on Jordan Poole. I'm going to have to manually on-ball this just to not let him hit the tray fade. It's the only thing he's looking to do with Jordan Poole is hit that tray fade. That's a unbelievable bounce pass. Can someone in the comment section tell me if that's intentional or if that's like... A fl if that was a fluke. His free throw is awful from what I remember. Okay, focus. Oh no, his free throw is good. As I miss. Oh. There we go. <gasps> I wouldn't even look good out of his hand. He bricked it. Mirasan, you know what? You knocked down the free throws. I trust you more than I trust KPJ at this stage. Okay, one for one. 78 rate of free throw, so it's not like he's a bad free throw. He hits that one. Let's go. All those KPJs if you miss two of those. 92. Missing two with KPJ was not fun. Should have been a... I wish I could be a coward like last year and put real player percentage on. Overcommit. Overcommit. That should be game. You saw his free throw is horrendous though. Okay, let's. Okay, just hold it a little bit longer than you'd you'd kind of hope to. Okay. And that is game. We had thirty. We can see the twenty-four, but that was a twenty-four thirty game of clutch time. With like. Two shots hit. Like literally like two shots hit in the entire game. Or two four-pointers hit. So yeah, we have Mirasan. Mirasan is just... He's just not full. He's just taco. He's literally... He's just Christmas taco. There's no difference. Like there's no need to have a Mirasan. He's just his amethyst. They're the same card. Look, they're, all, they're the same card. You're not going to notice the difference. If the amethyst is 3 KMT, just buy the amethyst. Like... I've never been so much so indifferent on a card. He is literally like... That's, that's literally what he is. He is a guy that is going to... Um, well, he's just gonna hit shots, I guess. Or say he's going to just be big. He's gonna be big. That's it. Send with my auctions. Get rid of him for like the 10 or 11k. And if I need, and Taco is the same job. And there's a Taco in this account. So, let's put him over 10, 950. It is what it is, lads. It is what it is. Not a bad card, but he's literally one thing and it's tall. That's, that's the only redeemable quality for Mirasan in this game, is that he's tall.